Hi people and welcome back to a new Minecraft episode. This is episode 21. Yes, so I've actually just come back from mining so I'm going to put my ore into the system right here and that can go around and be, you know, macerated and smelled and stuff and I'm going to put the rest of this crap away. Didn't really have much luck mining this time. Just a load of random crap. Is that a pig man again? God damn you pig man, stop. Invading my house. Unfortunately, our friend the slime has died though. I don't know where I don't know what happened to him. I just I think he might despawn because mobs despawn after a while. So I'm gonna take care of this the overly attached zombie pigman again. Alright. You're not having hugs. Get in your portal or die. I don't want you coming through. Okay? Okay! You wanna die? Yep, yeah, you wanna die. No need to get angry when we try to break up. Just... Leave me alone. Actually, I've got level 31. Can enchant a new pickaxe? Should I enchant a pickaxe? I don't know. It's not really worth using all my diamond, is it? No. I actually do need a couple of spades. Let's make a couple of spades. Just be a few seconds. My wheat farm's going re really well as well. I've got like a stack and a bit of wheat in that farm. And as you can see, I've decorated a bit. And I've got room for a second farm there. It's not going to be a a wheat farm again. It'll probably be a tree, form, tree farm or a neverwalk farm or a melon farm or something like that. Ooh, how are these going? I've got like so much, so many bars already, it's kind of funny. I can't even remember what I was going to do today. Oh yeah, that was it. Right, so we're going to need some flowers for today. Yes, we're going to need some flowers. We're going to need a diamond. And... I think that's it. Oh yeah, we need some water as well. Couple buckets of water. Have we got any buckets? We have. Wait. Oh, I didn't. Oh, that's it. Stupid. Well, right, it's finally it's time to turn off stupid mode. Recipe mode. Screw you. Screw you. Right. Was I gonna get two buckets? Two buckets. There you go. Awesome. So I'm not sure what to do with the rest of the village. I'm thinking of having separate houses for things like an alchemist house for, for potions and just different houses, you know. Peat fried chicken, of course. And other things like that. Alright. So you'll see what I'm going to do in a bit. I still haven't finished this damn barn either. Need to make my chicken farm in there. I'm, I'm thinking of using a... Like the, in Vanilla Hills, I had like the... The chicken farm where the the chickens lay on some water, the eggs drop down. Thinking of doing that, but having an obsidian pipe below which sucks up the eggs and puts them in the chest. So that'd be nice. Won't have to collect the eggs every time. So anyway, we're going to get to what we're going to do here. And get a couple of buckets of water. Now I need to think of a good place to put this. We need a 2x2 two two pool of water. And we can't really put it in my basement. We could, I guess, but hmm. Let's put it in front of the barn. Why not? I actually bred the animals again. Right. So we need a two by hole, two by two hole. Let's use my shovel. I should have used my portal gun to get over it. I know people keep complaining about that, but. Right, two or two portal water. And we're going to put flowers around it. You may be wondering, what the hell am I doing? You'll find out soon. Alternate them. And this will hopefully work. Where's that diamond? And diamonds! Yeah! We created a portal. And this portal should, if it works, it doesn't crash my game. Please work. 
Shit, take me to the Twilight Forest. Yes! What the hell's that? Ah! We're under attack! We're under attack! We're poisoned! Oh, what the hell? Uh, we're gonna nick you off your spawner and put it somewhere else. Not next to my thing here. Yeah. Okay. Your spawner can go over here somewhere. Just gotta remember where we pull it, of course. I don't know if you can take it back through the portal. That'd be pretty cool if you can. For now, you're gonna stay here. And we're gonna mark it. Spawner. Alright, let's get away from that now. We need to... We need to mark our portal as well. Where was we? We are near this house, wasn't we? Is there any loot in here? No? Okay. Alright, let's mark this off. This is our... Portal. To the normal world. So, we're in the world of... Twilight Forest. And the ground is messed up. Stupid chunk errors or whatever. It's because I'm recording and just went to a new dimension. Kinda happens. Alright, so we got that now. That's pretty nice. What's this? I've also been to the Twilight Forest before in other seasons. Let's hope this is not... Yeah, this is going to be a never-ending drop to my doom, isn't it? Stupid well. So, what else we got? Another ruins. I, I kind of like the Twilight Forest. It, oh, I, I saw a... What the hell? A squirrel that blasts off and is fiery. Oh my god. Well, at least we killed it. That could have damaged... This has got like all kinds of cool trees in it. There's a building over here I can see on my mini map. Let's go and have a look. It's gonna have another one of them spawners in, isn't it? Yup. Time to get this. Oh yeah. The tree's on fire! Oh no. I wonder if we can actually take this through the portal. I'm gonna try this time. If not, this spawner's gonna be destroyed. But what are you? So many new animals in this world. If we can take this block through the portal, we'd be pretty pro because that means we can also take Blaze spawners <laughs> through. I'm not sure why I'd want to do that into a wooden house, but does this work? No. So what happened to that? What happened to the spawn? Oh, they put the spawner here. All right. Alright, we'll put you with the other spawner down this way. So this we now got a way to go to the Twilight Forest. We can do some more cool stuff over this way eventually. But for now, we've just got our entrance way in. It's something that people request that I go to here. And I've been here now. It's not the same, I'm not coming back. Of course I'm coming back. In fact, we need to finish, make sure this portal's finished. So, I'm going to go back to the normal world now. And hopefully we can figure out some stuff to do in the Twilight Forest. There's, this forest is really awesome though. Right, we're going to go back through. Here we go. We should actually mark this. Just mark this with... Twilight... I was going to write Twilight Sucks because the movie does. I don't like it. My opinion. And it's Twilight Portal. So look in our barn. You can see many animals. One sheep in the floor. Alright, so we got that done. Why is the world glitched? Why you do that? You know, I've actually added two mods <laughs> since last episode. I did the shutter mod and the barbecue mod. I had to have the barbecue mod because of, I'm Captain Barbecue. If you ever watch my Skyrim series, you know what Captain Barbecue is. So I need somewhere nice to have a barbecue to think about. I need to build some like decking or something so I can have a barbecue outside. 
Where's a good place to build a barbecue then? Right. Don't want it out front really. Could do it around the side here, build some decking and have a barbecue there. I kinda like that idea. I've got two golden hoes now, I don't want any garden hose. Could actually build like sort of maybe make it like a gazebo type thing as well. Don't know, what do you think? Is it safe to have barbecue on wooden floors? Probably not. Hmm. Be my barbecue area here. Right, there's our decking. How do you build a barbecue? Barb. B. Aha, uh -huh, there it is. So it's ironing. It's like pants with a furnace. Okay. I'm not going to use the same joke the Yogscars did because that would be silly. Right, so we need iron and a furnace. In fact we're going to have like four barbecues. Let's take a lot of iron. Some cobble. Let's build this. Let's have four barbecues. These are like really cool. You have to use charcoal with them. You can't use normal coal. I tried and it didn't work. I shouldn't have even made that vest. I should have made the furnaces. Come on. I wish the crafting f table 3 would update to 1.3.2. Unfortunately, the mod grayer is disappeared into the dust somewhere. Alright, we got some barbecues. Hell yeah. Let's go outside and... I like barbecues in place, alright. Just gonna put a little barbecue area here. Right, so. Fingering, how long is this? One, two, three, four, five. I'm gonna make it six. I'm gonna have my barbecues along here. Awesome, we've got a little decking area here. Maybe we should build some stairs or some ramping or something. We need to fill the underneath with dirt. Hmm. Kind of like this barbecue area. I want to kind of want to demonstrate this as well before I end the episode. For those that haven't seen it, it's really awesome. Depends if I've got any raw meat. I have got some raw beef. We're gonna need some. We're gonna need some charcoal. So let's put it in this furnace. Charcoal. Why is there a gap there? Here we go. Charcoal's coming out really thick and fast here. Let's just take this stack of 12 for now. Alright, it's time for barbecue. Barbecues are like so awesome. I need to, I'm not really a good builder so I need to feel, find out a way how to improve my deck in here to make it like a little more decorative. Mm. Mm. Maybe we could have like a wall bit coming over. Alright, so charcoal each one of these. Alright, two charcoal each. Now let's spam this thing with meat. Spam this thing with meat. And they should get cooked. They go brown. And then they're almost ready. Watch, watch this. Whee! Yeah! Hell yeah! This barbecue mod is awesome, I love it. Captain Barbecue Returns. Look at all that. Shame you didn't get XP, but... I don't care, that's awesome. Oh yeah, Captain Barbecue's returned. That was like a really fast way to cook a crap ton of meat, anyway. So... We've been to the Twilight Forest. We've tons of barbecue in. Uh, good episode. I approve. Let's put all this crap away. There we go. All in there. Charcoal. Meh. Charcoal can go in here because it is like... I'm going to count it as a food stuff now. Because I'm going to use it for food. Two golden hose. I don't really care. 
Alright. Oh, you've already done all that stuff, have yeah? Charcoal. So, for the final bit of the episode, I guess I could... You know, people hate it. Some people hate it. So the power. I need more power, I think. So at some point, I'm... Oh, that's not even full yet. Damn. So at some point, I'm going to need, like, a massive amount of power to go through this area. Through my... So I'm going to have three electric engines here and do more power. Because then it can power this, and it'll be able to power a quarry. I really want a quarry. I don't know where I'm going to put a quarry yet, because maybe I'll put it out in the desert. Because I don't want it in the village. So I can't even remember what I was going to do. I, was... <laughs> I probably should just end the episode here, really. There was something else I was going to do. The next farm I'm going to make is going to be... Oh, an infernal farm. Is that what's for never war? I don't know. Rubber farm. That combine. Logger. Pumpkin farm. If there's a pumpkin farm, where's the melon farm? I think, I think pumpkin and melon scout as one. Mushroom farm. I think infernal farm is for never warts. I'll find out. Before the next episode. Probably. Maybe. So I hope you're enjoying the series so far. The mix of machinery, dimensions, and some building, and some random crazy stuff like slimes teleporting up here. And yeah. Should finish off the barn before the next episode as well. The, well, the roof anyway. And I need to build my chicken coop with the obsidian pipes. So that is done, and we built some decking, so I'm going to end the episode anyway. I'm talking too much crap now. So anyway, as usual, don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, follow me on Facebook and Twitter, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.